C I E T N C E R T presents audio book of mathematics for class 6 chapter 8 decimals page 174 part 3 8.4 comparing decimals can you tell which is greater 0 0.07 or 0 0.1 Take two pieces of square papers of the same size. Divide them into 100 equal parts. For 0 0.07 we have to shade 7 parts out of 100. Now 0 0.1 is equal to 1 upon 10, equal to 10 upon 100. So for 0 0.1 shade 10 parts out of 100. 0 0.07 is equal to 7 upon 100. 0 0.1 is equal to 1 upon 10 equal to 10 upon 100. This means 0 0.1 is greater than 0 0.07. Let us now compare the numbers 32.55 and 32.5. In this case, we first compare the whole part. We see that the whole part for both the numbers is 32 and hence equal. We however know that the two numbers are not equal. So we now compare the tenth part. We find that for 32.55 and 32.5, the tenth part is also equal. Then we compare the hundredth part. Page 175. We find 32.55 is equal to 32 plus 5 upon 10 plus 5 upon 100 and 32.5 is equal to 32 plus 5 upon 10 plus 0 upon 100. Therefore, 32.55 is greater than 32.5 as the hundredth part of 32.55 is more. Example 11. Which is greater? A. 1 or 0 0.99? B. 1.09 or 1.093? Solution. A. 1 is equal to 1 plus 0 0.10 plus 0 0.100. 0 0.99 is equal to 0 plus 9 upon 10 plus 9 upon 100. The whole part of 1 is greater than that of 0 0.99. Therefore, 1 is greater than 0 0.99. B. 1.09 is equal to 1 plus 0 upon 10 plus 9 upon 100 plus 0 upon 1000. 1 1.093 is equal to 1 plus 0 upon 10 plus 9 upon 100 plus 3 upon 1000. In this case, the two numbers have same parts up to 100. But the thousandth part of 1.093 is greater than that of 1.09. Therefore, 1.093 is greater than 1.09. Exercise 8.3 1. Which is greater? A. 0 0.3 or 0 0.4? B. 0 0.07 or 0 0.02? C. 3 or 0 0.8? D. 0 0.5 or 0 0.05? E. 1.23 or 1 1.2? F. 0 0.099 or 0 0.19? G. 1.5 or 1 1.50? H. 1.431 or 1.490 I 3.3 or 3.300 J 5.64 or 5.603 2. Make 5 more examples and find the greatest number from them. Try these. 1. Write 2 rupees 5 paise and 2 rupees 50 paise in decimals. 2. Write 20 rupees 7 paise and 21 rupees 75 paise in decimals. 8.5. Using decimals. 8.5.1. Money. We know that 100 paise is equal to 1 rupee. Therefore, 1 paise is equal to 1 upon 100 rupee, which is equal to 0 0.01 rupee. So, 65 paise is equal to 65 upon 100 rupee which is equal to 0 0.65 rupee and 5 paise is equal to 5 upon 100 rupee equal to 0 0.05 rupee. What is 105 paise? It is 1 rupee and 5 paise. 
which is equal to 1.05 rupee. Page 176 8.52 Length Mahesh wanted to measure the length of his table top in meters. He had a 50 centimeter scale. He found that the length of the table top was 156 centimeters. What will be its length in meters? Mahesh knew that 1 centimeter is equal to 1 upon 100 meter or 0 0.01 meter. Therefore, 56 centimeter is equal to 56 upon 100 meter which is equal to 0 0.56 meter. Thus, the length of the table top is 156 centimeter equal to 100 centimeters plus 56 centimeters which is equal to 1 meter plus 56 upon 100 meters equal to 1.56 meters. Mahesh also wants to represent this length pictorially. He took squared papers of equal size and divided them into 100 equal parts. He considered each small square as 1 cm. We have the two pictures here. The first one shows 100 cm, the second one 56 cm. Try these. 1. Can you write 4 mm in cm using decimals? 2. How will you write 7 cm 5 mm in cm using decimals? 3. Can you now write 52 meters as kilometers using decimals? How will you write 340 meters as kilometer using decimals? How will you write 2008 meters in kilometers? Try these. 1. Can you now write 456 grams as kilograms using decimals? 2. How will you write 2 kilogram 9 grams in kilograms using decimals? 8.5.3 Weight Nandu bought 500 gram potatoes, 250 gram capsicum, 700 gram onions, 500 gram tomatoes, 100 gram ginger and 300 gram radish. What is the total weight of the vegetables in the bag? Let us add the weight of all the vegetables in the bag. 500 grams plus 250 grams plus 700 grams, plus 500 grams, plus 100 grams, plus 300 grams, equal to 2,350 grams. Page 177 We know that 1,000 grams is equal to 1 kilogram. Therefore, 1 gram is equal to 1 upon 1,000 kilogram, which is equal to 0 0.001 kilogram. Thus, 2,350 grams is equal to 2,000 grams plus 350 grams equal to 2,000 upon 1,000 kilograms plus 350 upon 1,000 kilograms which is equal to 2 kilograms plus 0 0.350 kilograms equal to 2.350 kilograms that is 2,350 grams is equal to 2 kilogram 350 grams equal to 2.350 kilograms. Thus, the weight of vegetables in Nandu's bag is 2.350 kilograms. Exercise 8.4 1. Express as rupees using decimals. A. 5 paise. B. 75 paise. C. 20 paise. D. 50 rupees 90 paise. E. 725 paise. 2. Express as meters using decimals. A. 15 centimeters. B. 6 centimeters. C. 2 meters 45 centimeters. D. 9 meters 7 centimeters. E. 419 centimeters. 3. Express as centimeter using decimals. A. 5 millimeters. B. 60 millimeters. C. 164 millimeters. D. 9 centimeter 8 millimeters. E. 93 millimeters. 4. Express as kilometer using decimals. A. 8 meters. B. 88 meters. C. 8888 meters. D. 70 kilometers 5 meters. 5. 
express as kilogram using decimals a 2 grams b 100 grams c 3750 grams d 5 kilogram 8 grams e 26 kilogram 50 grams you were just listening to the audiobook mathematics for class 6 narrator gaurav marva assistance in production soumya malik producer vimlesh chaudhary presented by c i e t n c e r t new delhi india